Good afternoon guys, this is Training University here back with another video. This is my fourth video to be exact on this channel today guys and I'm so excited to edit and post and make these videos because I know these videos can change your lives today. And if you guys are watching this video right now, you guys are new on my channel guys, I would prefer to go watch my previous video on my channel on combination of the four best indicators on IQ options, IQ option strategy on trends um, i was making big profits if you didn't see that video i would prefer to go check it out right now the link will be in the description down below and don't forget guys give a big fat like on my video i can see you guys are enjoying my video and let's try to reach at least seven likes on this video today and i will appreciate it so much and guys if you want to leave a comment by all means guys just leave the comments right there if you want any questions Give a nice shout out to Shamilia Ev who said nice. He really loved the video. And if you guys can see, I will give a heart on each comment you guys give me. I will also reply if needed. And if you guys want shout outs on my videos, guys, I'm still waiting for people to send me links of the YouTube channel so I can do a shout out video. I'm just waiting for a few more people. But then I will do the shout out video this week. I'm just waiting for a few new people. I'm posting it on Facebook to see where it goes. But guys, leave the comments and for to not to take much of your time let's start with today's video okay guys so in today's video i'm really excited to share this strategy with you guys and this is literally the most natural strategy all traders use worldwide forex traders binary traders daily traders weekly traders doesn't doesn't matter this is one of the popular strategies and i'm gonna I'm going to go through this strategy step by step with you guys to show you how it works. We're not going to use any indicators to help us on the trains to show us when there's a signal coming. We're going to use two things. We're going to use support and resistance. If you guys never heard about support and resistance, um, resistance is when the trains or the candlesticks hits the highest point before it pulls back. That is what we call a resistance for on euro and us dollar for example by the way is as you guys can see the, the market went up and it is the highest point where it reached and it pulled back and it went down so that is what we call a resistance right here and this is a very very good resistance to be honest because it pulled back again and guys then support is when the market goes down and it reached the lowest point on the market and it reach back up means that is going to be the support so now that you guys mostly understand what a support and resistance i'm gonna show you how we use how i draw my lines to give me the, the lowest support and the highest resistance and as well we get normal resistance and support so i got a little bit of a, a trick in my strategy or in this support and resistance strategy to show you that you can put your higher support and resistance but it's also in between lines that can help you to make quicker trades for example if it is a very strong uptrend as on here in us dollar as you guys can see it's a very strong uptrend so we will focus more on the support breakdown horizontal line so let's put it right there boom so this is a very very strong support line so as you guys can see it went down it reached its lowest lows and it went back up so that's a very good support line and as you guys can see it then went down and then here again it went down and it pulled back up and it went back up so that's a very very good support line where you can put in a call trade but what i mean by breakdown for example as you guys could see on this one minute candlestick it went down and it pulled back up but on the next candlestick it didn't went up it broke through the support line and that is where you can get a good opportunity to put in a put or a lower call where it will be in the money so the strategy today we're going to focus on re the higher resistance and the lower supports and we're going to put support and resistance between between the higher and the lower support too so we can it's easily see when there's a breakthrough or a breakdown or a breakout to make it easier for us to put in a trade that will be in the money so we will this is only support but I can let's let's put one for resistance as well 
so I can show you guys how I do my trades and to make it much easier okay so let's first start with the resistance this is a resistance as you guys see so it, the market went up it pulled back and on this candlestick it went down so there I will put in a put for four minutes so from this candlestick after it is done I will put a put for four minutes on the next candlestick and as you guys can see one two three four it is in the money and let's go back to support to make it easier so as you guys can see it went down and it pulled back up so this is a very very strong support line on 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 this candlestick and as well on the second one so there is two winning trades so when it pulls back on the support on the next candlestick you put in a call for a, for the next four minutes so from when it pulled back up and this candlestick finished i will put in a call in for the next four minutes and as you guys can see one minute two minutes three minutes four minutes five minutes that is in the money and then there is one more thing that i want to show you guys that we're going to work on today and i'm going to show you step by step is when there's a breakthrough when the market breaks the support or resistance then you wait on the next candlestick then you put in a put for five minutes five minutes guys when it breaks any support or resistance you put in a put or a call for five minutes so on this candlestick i would put it in a put for five minutes and it you'll see one two three four five and it's in the money so that means this support line or there is it this support line changes to a resistance now where you can see with the market it's changed to resistance but then you wait then you wait to see if the market will go up to the resistance now because it broke through the support so it changed it to resistance now so when it went through now you wait for the market to go back up again so you can see if this will still be a resistance but as you guys could see the market slowly went up again and on this candlestick it it pulled back but on the next candlestick it broke through the resistance and that gave you an opportunity to tell you that it changes to a support again where on this candlestick you wait until it's finished and on the next candlestick you put in for a call and as you guys can see one two three four five it is in the money guys please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and put on the notification bell for any new content and strategies coming up on my channel every week come on let's go so i'm gonna go through this five markers to show you guys that how it works exactly in i'm gonna do the first one so we're gonna take our horizontal line again and we're gonna put the highest resistance right there and then we're gonna get another one out and we're gonna put the lowest the lowest is right here this is the lowest support guys and if i'm correct this is exactly the highest resistance because it's a very very strong uptrend literally going on the earring is killing it so then in between we're gonna put another support right oh we're gonna put another support right here yeah, you, you guys can see so there may, there may be a chance for a signal to come up and then we also gonna put the resistance in there let's see let's see here boom this is a very nice resistance the pullbacks on the resistance here is very strong okay so let me just go put in the rest of it and then we can move on okay guys while i was busy putting my resistance supports 
on on the markets i slowly <laughs> missed that the market broke through both resistance and i missed this trade i slowly saw with the second candlestick here that the pullback is very strong so this will be the next resistance so i put it in a put for not four minutes because i missed a little bit of this trade but i put it in for i think three minutes there's a pullback on the first candlestick so i waited for this one to just to make sure it'll be a it'll be a resistance so this will be the perfect highest resistance to put in a trade that it will be in the money and i accidentally put it in ten thousand dollars but it's worth it i took the risk i didn't see my amount guys make always make sure to, to check your amount be, before you put in the trade but if you're confident by all means but this will be the first so i'm very happy about this one uh we're in 188,000. so let's check the next trade i just want to tell you guys in each market where we're going to focus on to, to make it easy and simple, you must see where the trend is going. If, if it's an uptrend and it's going up, then you must focus on the supports, guys. On the supports, on the supports, you see, on the supports. There's more supports than resistance in this, this market. Watch where the trend is going. If it's an uptrend, you focus on supports. And if it's a downtrend, you focus on resistance. And that's what would be in the money. All right, guys. So there is a very good opportunity because on the support level, as you guys can see, the market went down. There was a pull up. And then on the next candlestick, it slowly went up. So I'm going to put in a call for four minutes to be exact and let's go on the next candlestick guys you must always remember like i said in all my videos make sure that you got your money management right on your account but if you put in a trade to make sure if you lose that trade that you will have backup money so that you can always put in the next trade to make up for the trade you lost get daily targets to help you grow your account again i would prefer to go download this broker platform and iq options it gives you a free ten thousand dollar practice account to help you grow to practice strategies to give you the the confidence to put in real money and to make a difference in your life a second trade and it is in the money so i'm very glad about this so let's go to great britain us dollar to see if there's any opportunities coming up third signal on a support line that was in the money <laughs> guys this is guys please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and put on the notification bell for any new content and strategies coming up on my channel every week come on let's go this was a pretty tricky one See, there's a lot of support and resistance but i'm gonna tell you the one i was focusing on to to make it to make it easier for you to to know what i'm talking about so um i was focusing on this big red candlestick so that it pushed down big and and it made a nice support line right here and went back up so I waited for this green candle to to finish um, in the last few seconds. I was putting in a call, a higher opportunity. I, was, I wasn't I was pretty sure about the doji pin, but then I realized that it went down. This is a support line again, and it went down and it pushed it back up. And I was like, no, this will be in the money. So I put it in for three minutes in in total, to be honest. I was so confident and it went up and was in the money guys we just made a few thousand dollars on support and resistance <laughs> it's no difficult signal or strategy to use this is exactly the most common strategy people are using around the world on any broker platform you can make money out of this guys go practice Get this broker account and IQ options, link will be in the description down below. Go practice today.
you can download the app on play store get the ten thousand dollars and start practicing on support and resisting i promise you it will make your life easier it can make a difference in your life to making money on this and i hope you guys really enjoyed this video and if you guys didn't see my previous videos it will be in the link in the description down below i would prefer you guys need to go watch it right now <laughs> but thank you for all the people who are watching my video till the end i love you guys a lot i will see you guys next week on my next video coming up and i'm pretty excited about that one as well because i love making videos for you guys this is trading universe and i'm out